All right, Shalom, Shalom, Read the Real Hebrew Israelites, coming day in and day out to prophesy the downfall of Babylon the Great, which is America. First off and foremost, all praises, honor, and glory be unto Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Karkadash. Double honors to thee, all the apostles of great millstone, salutations to the elect, wherever you may be. Uh, Brother Shapaya from GMS Chicago, coming at you again with another quick little lesson to the spirit. Um, today's lesson, I, talk, I, I talked about it. I believe this past Sunday on Shabbat, but the spirit hopped back on me to speak about it because um, in this video, Elder Apostle Tahar had brought up a point, a valid point of scripture about how the Lord talks to the prophets, you know, shows them visions, you know, do, uh, do similitudes and things of that nature, which uh, and I believe he read this actual verse and I'm going to read it. Hosea 12 and 10, I have also spoken by the prophets and I have multiplied visions and used similitudes by the ministry of the prophets. You know, that's how the Lord deals with the prophets, especially prophets of old. And as you can see, the time we're getting back into, the Lord is really laying that spirit heavy upon brothers to see certain visions and to speak about them. You know, like, uh, matter of fact, let me get it. I believe it's Joel. Second chapter. The second chapter. 2 and 28. Joel 2 and 28. And it shall come to pass afterwards that I will pour out my spirit upon all flesh. And your sons and your daughters shall prophesy. Your old man shall see dreams and your young man shall see visions. All right? And we're going to speak about them. Now, in this video, let's go to. I did a video. Where is that? Right, two days ago. So this was Sunday on Shabbat, you know. And I was very heavy into the spirit, you know, praying to the Lord, you know. It, it, it was kind of funny because I, I was damn near prophesying to my damn self. You know, I'm just going over topics in my head and, you know, I'm praying to the Lord. You know, I'm releasing through the spirit, you know, you know. And, uh. Before I did a lesson, I'm tell you this, brothers. Before I did this lesson, this is uh, Revelations one. Before I did this lesson, uh, you can check it out if you want. The chariots of the Lord are flexing because some chariots uh, had, uh, you know, came to Illinois and they they flexed hard as hell. And you know, it, the, that video hardly got views. The the people that recorded it. All right. Um, before I even watched this video. And this is a similar to the Lord showed me right before I did the video. And that's why I did the video. Uh, I was looking up at my ceiling. And, you know, um, I think there was like a, st a stain on my ceiling. It's like a, 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 a couple of dots. I believe me and the brother, uh, Ritazawanya, had popped some champagne. <laughs> and it got on the ceiling, <laughs> you know. It's been up there for months. I, you know, I never, you know, I'm looking. I was like, okay, I got to get up there and clean it. So I'm looking at it. And all of a sudden, and like I said, I was heavy into the spirit. These dots start moving and they look they look gold. I don't know because, you know, the stain is brown, but they look gold and they start moving around. And it was like I, I felt like I was drunk. But, uh, you know, they start moving around and dancing. You know, I'm smiling. I giggled because I said, damn, those look like chariots, you know. And then all of a sudden they turn from bright gold to blood red to blood red brothers. I, I, you know, and I looked away. I just smiled. I said, damn, that's cold. Cause the Lord gave me the breakdown as I was receiving it. Basically, Yahweh and the angels are coming back for blood. All right. Cause he's coming back to deliver us. But at the same time, simultaneously, all right, the Lord is going to be slaying. Michael, the archangel is going to be slaying. All right, the, the angels of the Lord, hey, like it says, this is the curse that go over the whole face of the earth. They're coming back for blood. And that was the similitude I seen. Now, I, I wasn't going to do a video that night, none of that. Matter of fact, I end up doing about one, two, three. three I, I end up doing like four, uh, four videos that night, right? Like I said, I was heavy in the spirit. But then as I was doing this video about the chariots, the Lord made me uh, rethink of what he just showed me like less than an hour prior to me doing this video. 
And I said, damn, that's the spirit because I, I didn't, that video I did see of the chariots coming to Illinois, well, the video I did see of the chariots coming to Illinois, I had no idea I was going to do a video on it. And like I said, an hour prior to that, the Lord showed me. He literally showed me. And it was kind of, I say I was in a trance or something. Like, like I said, I felt drunk. I'm like, damn, why is this? You know, I had to shake my head. And I'm like, damn, that you know, that shit look raw. You know, it's moving and stuff. They golden, gold, you know. And then they just turn blood red. And as soon as they turn blood red, the Lord hit me instantly. Angels coming back for blood. I said, damn. So, you know, after that, I, you know, I'm praying and, uh, you know, I'm doing other sit downs. And as I'm doing this video, wow. the Lord had me speak about it a little bit. You know, it was heavy. I said, you know, I, I ain't even plan on making this video, but it's it, it was spiritual how the Lord showed me the similar to before I did the video. You know, so the, those angels. <laughs> hey, how about Shimei Al is coming back for blood, man? All right, revenge. Okay, it says the slain of the Lord is going to be from one end of the earth to the other. And so with that, that was that was just a uh, one of my uh, quick little similitudes. Not my similitude, but the similitude the Lord, you know, showed me. And I just wanted to share it with the brothers. All right. With that, you know, hey, if brothers, yeah, you have spiritual dreams. You don't know, speak about them. Now, I know what Paul said. Everyone has a prophecy. Everybody, you know, but uh, hey, if it's edifying and it's mean, mean, meaningful, you know, don't be afraid to bring it out, man, because the Lord is dealing, especially in these days. So with that, I'm going to say all praises, honor, and glory be unto Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Karkadash. Double honors to the other apostles, a great millstone and salutations to the elect, wherever you may be. A Bible ball.